What's up guys, it's Ride Height Rob here. Today we're in a little bit different location. We're down here in the north central Alabama. Uh, we're down here at Lewis Smith Lake, just outside of Coleman, Alabama. Um, today we've been doing a few different things. Um, we've been out here kind of graphing up. Haven't really found those big balls of shad that we look for in like Missouri, but today I'm gonna show you a little something and kind of teach you a few little tips and tricks on how to target these you know, late fall, early winter to deep winter fish on where they set up at. So today what we're doing is we're throwing an ice jig over some deep water and chasing these open fish away. So right now I've got my turret kind of located on some fish. Here are these rogue schools of fish that I'm finding. So you can see there's four or five of them. We've got bait in the area, but these fish are just kind of staying up in the column right now. Um, they're coming up and feeding. As you can see right now, they're rising up. So we're gonna go ahead and get a, a lure in there and see if we can't catch one. Just like that, we're hooked up. Oh, come off. Bet I got another one already. Yep. That easy. Gosh. I had to take this jacket off so you guys can keep seeing. There he is. So we're back up here. We got another school out here, about 40 foot. Put that jigging wrap on their heads. I was a little bit behind them. It's so important to hit where you're wanting to. You know, because that's an active school. They're eating. I just got to get it to them. Okay, that's a better cast. Coming up behind them. Still missed him. There we go. Sometimes they just don't eat. You know, that's a that's a thing. But here's another school. They'll eat. I promise you that. Oh, there's one. That feels like a better one, too. Oh. Poor little guy. A lot of times when you catch one like that, though, you'll bring the whole school out. So if you're quick and efficient, you can get right back in them. See if you can fire them back up. And sometimes catch doubles pretty quick. Well, like that time, I didn't get in there fast enough. They'd already come back down. When you're fishing team tournaments, you can get right in a hurry doing this. Tandem group. Got him. Got him. Oh, come on. Got him. Biggins. <laughs> they shrunk today. They have definitely shrunk. That's a large mouth. Mm. 
Got one. Feels like a good one too. Seen that school tossed down there and he ate it. Oh yeah, that's a real good one. Oh, look at that. All right. Guys, that's what it's all about. It's just about finding them schools, whether they're on the bottom, going through some shad or just up in the column. Getting them caught. Having a good time doing it. Yeah, this is what you're looking for. As you can see right there, there's a shad ball and you got seven to 10 fish underneath it, depending on what angle you can get that live scope at. But when you find this, you usually find yourself a few nice fish. <laughs>